After years of planning, the new Valley Metro bus station on 3rd Street is nearing completion. 10 News reporter Sydney Jacksheimer is working for you on when the new station will be finished, plus how riders feel about the upgrade. The new home for Valley Metro at the corner of 3rd Street and Salem Avenue is almost complete. General Manager Kevin Price says construction is ahead of schedule. Well, we finished the south canopy. Um, and so now we're working on the north canopy, which will house about 11 buses in, the, in their own individual slips. And they were also putting in new technology. The new station offers more space for riders with an indoor lounge and restrooms, which riders say they're pleased with. It's so much nicer uh, getting in and out. The new location hasn't come without pushback from community members like Beth Fitzpatrick, who's concerned about traffic, especially affecting businesses nearby. Norfolk Avenue, where it goes up through there, of course, provides access not only to the Transportation Museum, but also will be necessary for the school board's new offices and the buildings on further up. So uh, I hope they're not going to restrict traffic. Another concern, the buses that currently park on Salem Avenue while loading and unloading passengers. But Price says that's only temporary until the final canopy is complete. Those buses will transition over to their home in late April or May. So yeah, we're, we're getting close. In Roanoke, I'm Sydney Jacksheimer, 10 News, working for you.